The athletic training student will begin by positioning the patient with the hand and fingers in a neutral position. The ATS then applies tape adherent spray to the fingers and cuts a 1 8 inch foam or felt the length of the shortest finger to be taped. The buddy tape technique may be applied directly to the skin or over sport specific gloves. The ATS then applies a strip of half inch non-elastic tape around the foam or felt at the proximal end, then place the foam or felt between the fingers to retain anatomical alignment. The ATS encircles the fingers between the MCP and PIP joints with the half inch non-elastic tape strip with moderate roll tension. This lock and strip will prevent the foam or felt from dislodging and loosening during activity as perspiration and moisture begin to affect the tape adhesive. While maintaining alignment of the fingers, tape the fingers together with half inch non-elastic tape between the MCP and PIP joints, between the PIP and DIP joints, and around the distal phalanx if necessary, with three to five circular strips with moderate roll tension in the tape strips on the dorsal aspect of the fingers to prevent unraveling due to contact with equipment during activity. Do not place the tape directly over the joints. The ATS will then document the tape that has been done and verbally explain to the athlete when they should discontinue use.